Hello everybody. Hello. Actually I want to do a project on sensors, but I don't have enough knowledge about sensors. Do you know anything about sensors? Yeah, Gayatri, you're right actually. So we should know a lot about sensors, right? So I have a solution for it. So I have my two friends. So they are from IoT, so they'll be telling us a lot about sensors. So I think it will be a good option for us to learn a lot about sensors. Sensor is a device it detects and responds to input which comes from the physical environment. Now we can see here different types of sensors. This is an ultrasonic sensor. This consists of four pins. First one is VCC, second one is Trigo, next one is Eco, next Ground. This consists of four pins. VCC, Trigger, Ground and Eco. This is Transmitter and this is Receiver. Ultrasonic sensor calculates the distance between the sensor and the object. The sensor measures the time it takes between the em emission of the sound. This is a touch sensor. Touch sensor consists of four pens. Touch sensor detects touch of a finger or a stylus. Often touch of the sensors are classified into resistive and capacitive. This is a two color sensor. This consists of three pins. This consists of three pins. One is LED green, LED red and GND. A two color sensor are sometimes called as a double color LED. It emits two different colors of light. It is a semiconductor diode which lights up when voltage is applied. This is buzzer sensor. Buzzer consists of two wires, one is positive, one is negative. Buzzers are electric sounding devices that generate sounds. Typically powered by DC voltage, they can be characterized as piezo buzzer and magnetic buzzer. This is a LED display sensor. LCD is nothing but liquid crystal display. It is a flat panel display. Liquid crystals do not emit light directly, instead using a backlight or reflector to produce images in a color or monochrome. Next, humidity sensor. This is humidity sensor, the sensor that helps us in measuring the humidity of the surroundings. It contains an element that senses humidity. These are used in agriculture, industrial, medical purposes. It is a temperature sensor. It is also called as LN35. A temperature sensor consists of two types. One is no contact temperature sensor type. Another one is non-contact temperature sensor type. This is a tilt sensor. This has three pins. Tilt sensors produce an electrical signal that varies with an angular moment. These sensors are mainly used to measure scope and tilt within a limited range of the motion. This is a photo or assistor. This has three pins. This sensor uses light to detect the presence or absence of an object. This can be used to detect most materials like metal, plastic and wood. This is a button sensor. It has three pins. It is a switch module, is a push button that will close the circuit when pressed, sending a high signal. This is an infrared sensor. This is also called as IR sensor. It has three pins. It is a light based sensor that are used in various applications like proximity and object detection. These are two types IR transmitter and IR detector. Thank you. Thank you Sindhu and Shruti for providing us knowledge about these sensors. I'm really glad to gain this knowledge about different types of sensors. I'm really surprised that you know about a lot of things in first year only. May I know where you get this knowledge from? Actually, there is a lot of equipment in our Ace Engineering College. 
and faculty is also very interactive with us the faculty helped us a lot to know about the sensors and they gave a lot knowledge about sensors so that we know about sensors in our first year only okay.